Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to do Zlib compression in Node.js. So we are going to make use of module Zlib and going to compress one PDF file into gzip. Okay. So I have this demo.pdf file that I'm going to convert into gzip or you can say compress into instead of convert. Convert won't be the right word. So I'm sorry for that. So compressing this file and store it with gzip. Okay, so first thing I'm going to open text editor such as Visual Studio Code. And here first thing I'm going to write is calling for constant zlib and then check for require zlib. Okay, next thing constant gzip equals to zlib dot create gzip okay and next thing that we are going to do is we are going to similarly call for file system with require address okay then we are going to create one more input constant which is going to simply create that file into this gzip compression okay but for that first it needs to read that pdf file so create and then read string okay here simply use demo or oh, sorry should be demo.pdf that's the right path okay in the same directory then constant output so constant out is fs dot create write stream okay write stream we want to type it names as demo.pdf dot g zip so G flat. Okay, the next thing input dot here yeah, we have to pipe it with gzip, then pipe out with this format. Okay, that's it. We can execute this code and it should be available right here with a new compressed file name demo pdf gzip okay so i'm in same directory i'm going to execute node sample dot chase okay as you can see it executed perfectly uh, but there were some issues for example make sure that this c is not uppercase same with c here also make sure that only g here is uppercase and z is not uppercase okay now once you made those changes it should execute fine and it, it should show you no error and it should show you this gzip file okay demo pdf gz right here which you can open with 7-zip and have your PDF file viewed through it. Okay, so let me just see. Okay, so my PDF file is there. So it is properly compressed using Node.js Zlib module.